In the book of Matthew chapter 21, verse 33 to 46, we see the parable of the tenants. Now, this parable of the tenant made us to understand how our Heavenly Father sent a lot of prophets and a lot of people who has come and had gone um, to come preach the gospel. You know, just like it is in their own time, like in the time of Yahushua, during this time, obviously, when this this particular event happened. Like one thing I've noticed about the word of our father is that it's not just for a particular period of time. His words are always for every single generation that ever lives. His words are always alive for each and every one of us. So we see how this particular man, who was a husband and one man that was left to take care of the job that the person who rented this particular um vineyard to him to take care of the people literally you know killed every single person that came to you know ask for profits from whatever he was doing and to the point that this particular man had to send his son and immediately they saw him they had to kill the hair now this was literally talking about the pharisees and the sadducees of that time that literally went against yahushua and made sure that he was killed now this is also the same thing with this time when we leave whereby people do not appreciate the people who preach the gospel who speak about the word of the living god towards them may we not be found among those who are these people will not be found among those who will deteriorate or speak against the word of the living God. We will be among those who would appreciate the word of the living God and live for it and eat alone all the days of our life. We will be found among those who will sincerely serve the living God. The sheaf, the, the stone that the builders rejected shall become the cornerstone, meaning that those 